channel i know i haven't been here in a while but you know we're not here to discuss that what we're here to discuss is the jacqueline hill and morphe brush collection and the vault collection okay we're here to talk about this because it's my last looking up because i was about to say sis hold up but um we're here to talk about this because there's been a lot of things going on with the jacqueline hill vault collection you know like they pushed the date back because uh, people were saying that the prop, like it was patchy and blah blah blah, so they pushed the date back to, you know, fix the formula or whatever they had to do to it. And um, I don't know if people still saying something bad about it because I made sure I didn't watch no more reviews or anything because I wanted my review or whatever this is I'm doing, I wanted it to be authentic and literally how I felt about it. So I didn't watch nobody else. And I did um, get the brush collection and I was so happy like, okay, this is even better because like now I can use these brushes from her collection on the vault collection. So if you want to see how I achieved this look, please keep watching. This will be like a little mini series because I am going to do three more videos using the other three palettes that I did not use today. So yeah, if you want to see how I achieve this look and know some of my thoughts on the brushes or whatever, please keep watching. Okay, so as you guys can see from the intro, this is going to be a Jacqueline Hill video. I don't know what I'm going to call it yet, but I bought the um, box collection and I bought the, I just, this just actually came in the mail today. Like I just opened this package and I haven't even opened, I haven't even opened this all the way, as you can see. Um, and these are the brushes, her brush collection that she just came out with. With Morphe, so I decided to make a video of trying the brushes with the bulk collection. So, so I don't know if this video is gonna be like a review type thing. I never did one of those, so I don't know what I'm doing, but whatever. And I feel like oh, this whole thing, this brush set cost at one sixty five. I feel like it took forever to get here because um, it just came today and I ordered it on the day that it came out, the 28th. And yeah, I'm just now getting it. So these are all the brushes that came in this set, which I feel like is quite a lot, okay? Okay, let me make some room on my little bitty desk. And I really do like that it came with this this uh <laughs> this carrying case like i really like it and it's very pretty and glittery and like smooth like not smooth but like i don't know like you could wipe it off if it got dirty type of material so yeah be right back let me take all of these plastics off so we can get started all right, so first let's prime our eyes. I'm using this to put on my concealer because it feels like a little synthetic dense brush, but it's kind of big, but I feel like I feel like this will work. What you think? Super big, so do it nice and fast. I'm using the Maybelline Better Skin Concealer as the primer for today. And I am packing quite a bit on here just because, I don't know, of just what I'm doing right now. Yeah, I think I'm going to use the Rima Align Palette. This is the palette that I'm going to be using. And I do like how... Uh, the names are on here. Yeah, I'm gonna go in with Rush. Let's 
I like to see next time. Oh, wrong way. Oh, yeah. Don't look. My lace is still drying. So, yeah. Don't pay attention to that. And I'm just going to pass this on the outer part and then blend it inward. Because I don't know what kind of look I'm doing. Like, I don't know if I'm going to do a cut crease or what. But I do want this shade all over. It's a cute color. Nice transition shade. Okay. <laughs> yeah. I think I'm going to go in with alert. And what brush did I use? I used the JH30 for that one. And now I'm going to be using the JH36 to put alert all in the creasy, greasy, creasy. And I'm dragging this down here because I, I don't know, outer part of my eyeball. That's just what I'm feeling like. Really cute. This is a really pretty color. People is hating on her because this shit look nice, B. This shit look nice. I feel like people hating. I think I'm gonna go in with JH33. And I'm trying to see if I'm gonna use Secret. So this is, I'm sorry, y'all. This is, uh, Rush is right here. That's alert. And I'm trying to see if I'm going to use this color or, which is a secret, or if I'm going to go in with this color. I think I'm going to go in with secret. Just, and I'm going to be, I'm going to build a little bit at a time because I see that it was, And I'm just going to put this on the outer part and then deepen my crease. Yeah. Yeah, she has some pretty colors in here. I think I might do bomb ass, okay? I think I might do bomb ass. This is bomb ass right here. I'm going to use the JH41 to pick that up. And I really feel like um just need to be sprayed to get the full potential. But we're going to see. Um, I don't know. Yeah, I think so. I think it needs to be sprayed. Six plus. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, bitch. Oh oh my gosh. Oh my oh my god. Like bruh. Yo, I don't I don't know what the fuck to say about about that. I'm gonna do my wing, I'm gonna do my lashes, I'm gonna do my foundation, and I'm gonna come back for the rest of the face to continue with the face brushes. So I'll be right back. <laughs> this is so cute. I just can't get over it. I just can't. I just can't. Okay, so I actually changed my mind about uh coming back with my foundation. My foundation done. I did prime though. Um, I'm going to use the Anastasia Stick Foundation and I'm going to use the Jaclyn Hill 03 brush to buff that out. I normally don't use this, even though there's nothing wrong with it. I just been using my Fenty lately or whatever. So, <sighs> yeah, like I just haven't used this in a minute. Even though, like, this used to be my go, my go to. But when I do this, I do like to wet my brush. So I am going to spray it with the 
Fix Plus. And I did watch a video of Jacqueline's. And she did say that this brush is just like the Morphe whatever, whatever brush. <laughs> I don't really know. Like that. But the ones that she made just like uh the Morphe brushes, she said it. Like, it ain't no fucking surprise. She said that shit. She was like, this is a duplicate. Um... And she said that she wanted to have one just like that in her collection because these are the brushes she felt like she can't do her makeup without them. So, I don't know why people seem here, you know, going crazy and stuff. Like, oh my gosh, these are the same brushes I'm not going to pay. Well, shut up. Did anybody ask you? Did she ask you like, are you gonna pay? Are you gonna pay for this? Are you gonna get those brushes? No, she didn't. So, like, who cares? If you're not gonna get it, you're not gonna get it. But I like to go in with uh the Sephora Micro Smoothing Powder. And I'm going to use this big, fat-ass brush because I just feel like it's big and fat. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> They'll be dusty. Uh, this is the JH01 palette. I mean, fucking brush. So I'm just going to pounce this in here. And then just on the rest of my face. This brush is huge, okay? I like it. I like big fat brushes. I'm gonna use the Anastasia. Oh, I just picked up a lot. Anastasia uh, Beverly Hills bronzer in mahogany. Shit, that was a lot, B. Oh my gosh, I like this. This is the. JH02 brush and I'm just gonna mix on a little bit. I am gonna use this for something though. I'm gonna use it for this. Then I'm gonna take this big ass brush again and just dust that away. I went a little, a little bit below my waterline. Uh, my waterline, not a lot, just a little bit. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna use this. JH39 brush to uh smoke that out using I think I'm gonna use Secret, which was that brown color that's back here. Yeah, baby. I like this brush. This brush get right up in here. I'm gonna do alert this one. I'm gonna use JH37 and I'm gonna buff, buff that out, blend it into that brown, but a little bit below it. Oh, <laughs> that's so cute! You can't say it's not, but now moving on to the face, I'm going to be using the NYX blush. I'm going to use her blush brush, and I think it is this one. If I'm not mistaken, the JH04. I'm 
and I kind of like blending my brush into my bronzer. That's what I've just been feeling. I use the MAC. And then I let that soak in, seep in to my skin. Then I'm going to go in with the Jacqueline Hill, uh, the JH09 brush. And this brush is for highlighting. So I'm going to highlight with this brush. Damn. Only when you turn your head and you get that bitch. Who is that? Nigga. She said she made a, a brush strictly for brow bone. And I don't even know which one it is, but I'ma guess it's I'ma guess it's this one. Cause it's small and I feel like it can beep beep right there so easily. This is the JH42 brush and I'm gonna Oh yeah. I bet you this the brush. Bitch, bitch, who is she? Who is she, bitch? Who? Oh my. Oh my god. This look is nice and fall. I just gave y'all a fall ass look with the rainy alarm palette. I'm gonna put a little bit in my. Up in there. Oh, shoot. Going with the Too Faced Melted Matte. I don't even know what color this is. Sell out. Okay, so this is the finished look <clears throat> yes tell me how you like it um y'all I really like like the vault collection I mean I don't know if I like all of them because I haven't used them yet but the rain alarm palette boo I like it okay I like the brushes like I like it like it wasn't nothing I have nothing negative to say about it at all um, I really like how my look came out. The brushes were really soft and good. And it was a, I felt like it was a brush for every single thing, which you can't go wrong with that, especially, you know what I'm saying? If you're doing a full face like this, you need all the brushes that's in that collection. And I'm really happy that I did this and got it like, <laughs> yeah. So I'll just see y'all in my next video. Um, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see y'all later. Peace.